Well, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. 1973 Caboose here with an update. Yeah, another one. Big deal. We have uh, almost completely bought out on any more trains. So I p picked up a couple week a week or so ago with uh, two passenger sets, which you've seen in another video, a, a New Haven passenger train set, just the cars. The New Haven engines I've already had. So I was been running that passenger set with the RS3s and the FL9. And uh, the other set that I have is the Southern Pacific Daylight. And uh, one of the engines is not or from originally from this set. I have like four A units and one B unit in daylight colors in the match and passenger set. And uh, even got a Southern Pacific Black Widow SD9. And some other odds and ends. But we've been testing out... These steam locomotives right there, them three, and the Jupiter, the red and silver one, like right next to the SP Daylight, right between the Conrail and the SP Daylight equipment. We're going to put this guy on next. This is a consolidation. I never had one of these on the layouts first, I know. And it's Long Island Railroad 156. We're going to see how good it does. And uh, we'll be showing a video of it in operation, but we've been testing out. We have a Virginia, Virginia and Tucky Railroad steam locomotive right between the Southern and the uh, Conrail units. Actually, the Southern steam locomotive and the Conrail GP8 on the branch line here. Every one of them has held out pretty good. So we'll be back. <laughs> 